So I want to talk about the microbiome of the skin. You may have heard of the microbiome of your gut, which is a hot topic these days, and rightly so. It's a fascinating and important thing that we live with trillions of microorganisms inside of us that help us absorb vitamins, that help us in all kinds of ways, that are in a symbiotic relationship with us. Most of them are. Some of them are not. Some of them are pathogen-causing. But we're talking about the ones that are kind of creating a certain milieu of uh, little organisms in different parts of our body. So we have a microbiome of our eye, of our nose, of our gut, um, of all kinds of parts of our body that help protect that, uh, the skin or that part of the body from pathogens coming in from the outside or from bacteria overpopulating an area, which is where you're getting a lot of the acne from. And what we don't want to do is use harsh, uh, really soap-based or kind of alcohol-based cleansers on the skin because what it'll do is it kind of strips down that microbiome, it's similar to taking antibiotics when you have an illness. It can be wonderful, but what you're doing at the same time is you're wiping everybody out and not leaving any, any more organisms there. And that can be a problem. So really want to cultivate kind of this garden of microorganisms. We don't want to wipe them all away. And then part of this idea is that if you dry the skin out too much, the skin's always trying to maintain um, the surface of the skin and the, and the pH balance of the skin and the oil level of the skin. And so if you get the skin really dry, the body thinks it's really dry, I need to do something. And it starts to produce more oil actually to remedy what it appears to be a very um, unbalanced situation to the body. So actually when you use these harsh acne cleansers on the skin, you can actually get more acne as a result. And that's the mechanism behind that. We also don't want to disrupt the skin barrier or this microbiome because it leaves room for these opportunistic bacteria and different things to kind of take hold and that's going to create more acne as well.